I wish I'd known about these years ago. If you're tall, you're gonna love them. If you're short, you're gonna love them. If you're average, well, they have something for you too. Overland Expo is full of tents and awnings, but it's always the smaller, more ingenious products that solve a problem that catch my eye, including this. It might not look like much, but this is the Seat Jacker from Desert Does It, which is a product originally designed to make seating in your vehicle more comfortable, but has evolved into a whole modular storage system. It's basically a block of American aluminum that's machined in St. George, Utah. It was originally designed for a Tacoma. If you're over six foot tall and you have ridden or driven in a Tacoma, you know how it is. So Joe, who owned a Tacoma and is a machinist, decided to come up with these to solve that problem. So how do they work? Well, it's actually a super simple idea. All you have to do is put these under the front of your seat. To do that, you loosen the back, you take the front two seat bolts out, slot these in, bolt everything back down again. And it's a process that's so quick and simple that I actually took these back out of my 4Runner just to make this video. What it does is lift the entire front end of the seat up, giving you a lot more natural driving position. If you've got long legs like me, it's really, really comfortable and it supports your leg. I can put my foot on the pedal and have my leg supported the entire length of the seat instead of where I usually used to sit much further back here and have nothing supported up here. Now, I know some of you are going to comment saying that you have an adjustable driver's seat. Well, I do too. I have this. I can move this up and down, but it is not the same. I don't know what it is about it, but it's a lot more comfortable having the front lifted rather than just tilted. Today they sell the seat jacket for a whole range of vehicles. Obviously you got them for the Tacoma where they started, the 4Runner where I've got them installed. And you can also get them in a couple other Toyota vehicles, several Lexuses, Fords, uh, Ram trucks, and of course Jeep. And these things are really popular. So much so that while I was checking these out at the Desert Does It booth at Overland Expo West, several people came over and basically thanked them for creating these things and talked about how awesome they are. And I agree, although I actually have one complaint and that's that I wish I knew about them back in 2019 when they first started creating them because they make such a difference on the long drives. Like I said at the start, these are great for tall people, but short people, they got you covered too. You can obviously still use these. They do lift the front of the seat, but they make a version that goes on the back as well. They'll lift the back up so you're raising the whole seat completely. Then of course, average people, well, they make their accessories. No Overland product is complete without accessories. And that's where this comes in. This is their multi-mount panel, and this one is designed to go onto the front of the seat jackers, but if you are an average height and you feel like you don't want seat jackers, then you can get a bracket that this attaches to instead, and your seat stays at the position it's at. And this thing's designed to attach a bunch of accessories, a bunch of attachments. You can put your own things on here, or you can get the stuff that they sell. On mine, I've gone for a couple of magnets. It's a really strong magnet. This one's holding my knife and if I shake it, it's not coming off. It doesn't matter how bumpy the road is, that knife's gonna stay on there. You could also put something like a seatbelt cutter or, or glass breaker, you know, some kind of emergency stuff on there. And talking of emergencies, that's where this comes in. Most of the space on mine is taken up by a fire extinguisher, which I actually have sitting right here. Because I think that a fire extinguisher is something that's really important to have close to hand and that you want to get to quickly. The quicker you can get to it, the sooner you can put that fire out and the less chance it has to spread. You can get several different mounts for fire extinguishers for different sizes. So you can get them from 2.65 inches up to three and a quarter inches. And all of the mounts come with this little foam insert here that you stick in. That way it's held really snug, it doesn't rattle around. And they all have this quick release as well, which I think is another really important thing. If there are other things that you feel like you need to get to in a hurry, they do have holsters for those too. There's one at Expo East that I'm pretty sure is for fruit snacks that you can get to on the go. And finally, since you are raising your seat by this much when you're using the seat jacket, you do open up a little bit of storage space under there. Under my driver's seat, I currently have my ham radio, but if you had something like an ARB compressor, they actually make a mount that can go under the seat and hold that there. And that's a great location for an ARB compressor because not only is it going to be easy to get to, but it's also going to be clean. You're going to pull in clean air from inside the vehicle rather than dusty air from in the engine bay. The difficult thing about a review like this is I can't actually show you how comfortable the seat is with the seat jackets. You know, something like this multi-mount panel, you can see that. It's cool. You can see how functional it is. You can understand how nice it is to have things that are easily accessible. Things like your knives, whatever you end up having in a holster, fire extinguisher, you know, that's useful stuff. You know that's good to have nearby. But really the best thing here, and the thing I love most of all, are the seat jackers. If like me, you're tall and you drive a bunch of miles, these things are well worth getting. They sell them for a ton of vehicles, so I'm not gonna list them all, but I'll put a link to their website in the description so that you can check them out and see what they've got for your vehicle. And I'll also put a link to the fire extinguisher. Thanks for watching.